Hi babes, welcome to my very first YouTube video. Um, did I film this in the right setup? No. Did I plan this at all? No. Uh, should I have? Absolutely. But this is where we're at and I'm going to just keep going. If you've never seen my stuff before, how are you here? But also this is my cat Mina. She helps. She's a helper. Also, she's obsessed with yarn just like mommy and she, this is like her favorite thing ever. I also want to say if you're like, what is this girl making? I make round weavings and when I I first started to make them my brain instantly went that looks like a titty so now I make round titty weavings and that's essentially what I do and sometimes I like to spice it up with a couple of other chaotic little crafts anyways I was telling everybody a story over on my TikTok about the time that I created a fireball in my house so essentially what happened is I had a kokodama hanging right above my where I put my laptop and and that is a Japanese like way of keeping plants that has everything tucked into a little root ball and mine was preserved. So I had a dried plant hanging above my laptop. Okay, are we painting a picture? A mental image for you, if you will. I also used to really, really like candles and I had a candle going at my laptop while I was working that started sputtering and in my stupid little monkey brain, I was like, okay, so I am going to pour water from my water bottle to make this candle go out because water make fire go bye-bye. Uh, let me tell you, if you think water made fire go bye-bye in this story, you would be wrong. What did happen is that a three foot tall column of flame shot up from that tiny little candle that's smaller than my hand and hit that kokodama and within seconds, a fireball that was my beautiful hanging plant smashed down onto my laptop where I was working. I started screaming every single one of my favorite curse words. My partner came in and in what was the sexiest, fastest thing I've ever seen, took an iron pot from our stove and pulled the fireball with his bare hands into that pot, shutting the lid and essentially fixing the entire problem that I just created. <laughs> As the dust and well, ash settled, I realized that I completely forgot about the fact that I was on a Zoom call with my employee who is now staring at us in open mouth horror. Anyways, I don't like candles anymore and this is my finished booby. It shows a reduction scar and I think she's fucking gorgeous. Boop.